You probably don't have to ask me why I joined the Hermes Board of Directors. You get to build a hypersonic airplane. Who's going to say no to that? One of the last things I did before leaving government service is take a picture with the A-12 in front of the CIA's headquarters. I love that period of aviation and particularly love that airplane. The fact that it still holds so many records for high-speed flight for an airplane that is, is now many decades old is a really sad statement. What happened to high-speed aviation? Why did we quit pushing on it? There is a desire being driven uh, not just by the Air Force or me when I was in it, it's now being pushed even at the presidential level to speed up transportation, to make points on the globe closer together in time if they can't be closer together in distance. So pushing beyond Mach 1 plus travel, which has already been done, been there, done that, and the Concorde's not here anymore. And now only militaries fly above the speed of sound, but only getting back to where we were does not achieve that vision that President Biden spoke of. We've got to go much faster. And so Hermes has picked a very good design where that first step into really high Mach numbers will completely change the way transportation can be done in future, but without having to be built of unobtainium. Right? The, the, the tech that they've picked be challenging, but not impossible to integrate together. And I think Hermes has laid out a great plan to crawl, walk, run, fly, and sprint their way to that goal line. And I'm delighted to join their board and to help them achieve their vision.